While monitoring individual Lambda functions is useful, most serverless applications consist of multiple services working together. To track performance problems or errors, you may need to follow a transaction from the source caller through a number of downstream services. You could do this by looking at each service's logs, but it's faster and more convenient to use a tracing tool like AWS X-Ray or a number of third-party tracing services. For X-Ray, you can use it to identify the transaction flow of Lambda functions, API calls, and service integrations. Tracing the timing of an invocation to find bottlenecks and failures, and performance tuning to find out where you can optimize your functions. To use X-Ray in Lambda, you can activate it in the Lambda console for a selected function or enable it in your infrastructure as code template. You may need to activate X-Ray for any other service you use, such as API Gateway or Step Functions. Your functions send trace data to X-Ray, and X-Ray uses the data to generate a service map automatically, along with trace summaries that you can search. You can instrument calls via the AWS SDK by wrapping the object with the X-Ray SDK and can instrument your code to add further information to your X-Ray traces to record other outgoing calls. You can view the service map in the X-Ray console. Here you can see a Lambda function that is behind an API gateway endpoint. If there are any errors, these are indicated in the icons. This trace shows how the request came through API gateway through the Lambda service and then onto the Lambda function. I can then jump to view the individual traces. Here we see a waterfall view of the time it took for the request to pass through API Gateway and Lambda. You can also see the trace information added from the SDK calls to DynamoDB within the Lambda function. You will also be able to see the init phase of your Lambda function and how long the various parts of the cold start process takes. This can be helpful to trace the exact timing of all SDK and other traceable calls within your code for optimization. There are a number of useful utilities as part of Lambda Pal tools to help with tracing for a number of supported runtimes.